Good evening. <laughs> Hello. It's, it's so good to be back here. It's been two and a half years, something like that, since we've been able to do a Pops concert. And uh, when we first started the music up again, it was sort of like they forgot how to sing this style of music. But, you know, they, yeah, they're there. They're there. The, uh, the theme of this evening is the Great American Songbook. And the Great American Songbook is, there's not an actual book, but it talks about, or it's compiled of music from like 1920 or so up to about 1965, stuff that you would hear over the radio or in a Broadway musical, and things that then become standard in the jazz idiom. And the wonderful thing about jazz is that it can take almost any style of music and adapt it to make its own. So you'll hear some songs that you think you knew what they were supposed to sound like, but we have a new jazz twist to them. And these are all songs that you may really want to sing along. Please don't. <laughs> okay? Okay. And then as far as these things are concerned, either please put them, take, turn them off or put them on silent, okay? Crying babies I can understand. No excuse for cell phones. So, again, thank you for coming out. It's wonderful to see you. It's wonderful to be here. And I hope you enjoy this evening. It's a gas.
Never saw the sun shining so bright. Never saw things going so right. Noticing the days hurrying by. When you're in love, my head Now, I noticed some of you at the end of the guitar solo tried to applaud. <laughs> and in jazz, that's exactly what you're supposed to do. You don't wait to the end of the song. You give it to him as he's done. So get up for Dave Weaver over there, folks. <laughs> Something that's happened here uh, in the late 20th and 21st century, early 21st century, is pop singers going into the jazz idiom, which is really a little different. It's sort of like Luciano Pavarotti singing Blue Skies. You know, they're, huh? But some of these, in particular, these three ladies that you're going to hear tonight have made that transition and it is just spectacular. One of the uh, first one is Linda Ronstadt, but we'll get to her later in the night. This next one is by, uh, recorded by Carly Simon, and she has an album out of all standards like you're hearing tonight. This is one of them, My Romance. And so I'd like to honor these three ladies tonight who have managed to bridge the gap and bring a new style of music to people who might not have heard it otherwise. So anyway, this first one, uh, based on uh, Carly Simon's song, My Romance.
For those of you who have not seen the musical Guys and Dolls, this next number might be a little strange. Now, let me put it out there that I don't necessarily condone gambling. I know that it happens. So here's Sky Masterson in the sewers of New York rolling dice to see whether he is going to have a whole bunch of his guys go to a Salvation Army meeting or not. That's why, luck be a lady, he's getting ready to roll the dice. So there's some other terms that you may or may not know. Um, coming out, okay, that's when you have a new shooter and he's coming out for the first time. So I've heard. <laughs> okay, and then you'll hear terms like roll them, roll them, okay, and things like that. And then at the very end, you're, you're going to hear him yelling, coming out, coming out, yeah! And that's what they, uh, a lot of times they do, again, so I've heard, when they roll the dice and then they say things like, you know, whatever, you know, seven. But again, that's what I've heard. So enjoy Luck Be a Lady. Luck be a lady tonight. Luck be a lady tonight. Luck if you've ever been a lady to begin with. Luck be a lady tonight. Luck be a gentleman see. Be a lady tonight. If you've ever been a lady to begin with. 
must remember this. A kiss is still a kiss. A sign is just a sign. The fundamental things apply as time goes by. And when two lovers woo, they still say, I love you. On that you can rely. No matter what the future brings as time goes by. Moonlight and lovers never on a day. A soul of passion never sees me.
This next number is sung by the women only, and it's the Linda Ronstadt hit, What's New? She was listening to some old Frank Sinatra albums and decided she liked that type of music and she was going to try and sing it. So she got hold of the greatest arranger of popular and jazz standards, Nelson Riddle, and uh, went, went with him and they dug up tunes and he arranged them and put out this album that nobody thought could be done because Linda, let's face it, she was a rocker. Yeah, I mean, you know, she, she was a rock and roll singer, and then all of a sudden she's doing these standards. She also, at some point in her career, had the lead in uh, the Gilbert and Sullivan musical Pirates of Penzance. This lady could sing anything, anything, and do it well. And so this is our second of three who have bridged that gap between pop and jazz in the Great American Songbook. Here's what's new.
is is Melissa here tonight? Just Hi, Melissa. This month is a rough month for the church. We are losing two wonderful staff members. Brandon and his family are being forced to move to Hawaii for work. And Melissa and her family decided to go along with them. <laughs> so we will miss both of them and their families dearly. But just for you, Melissa, this song we dedicate to you.
my dramatic walk was ruined. <laughs> yeah. My mama done told me when I was in pigtails. My mama done told me. Hun, a man's gonna sweet talk and give you the big eye. But when the sweet talking is done, a man is a two-faced, a worrisome thing who'll leave you to sing the blues in the night. Now the rains are falling, hear the train of calling. Ooh, my mama done told me.
Choir doesn't know I'm doing this. Neither do those guys back there. There was a movie, well actually it was a musical first and then a movie called Durberry Was a Lady by Cole Porter. And Cole Porter happens to be one of my favorites. This movie starred the incredibly hot romantic duo of Bert Lahr, Cowardly Lion, and Ethel Merman. Why they didn't catch on, I don't know. <laughs> but it's a wonderful little song, and it's called, Do I Love You? Yeah. Uh. 
laughter that sweet summer afternoon when for the first time I saw you up here dreaming of you I composed a tune so will you listen to it Doesn't one and one make two? Do I love you? Do I? Does July need a sky of blue? Would I miss you? Would I if you would go away would the sun dip desert the day what would life be what would life be will I leave you never could the ocean leave the shore? Will I worship you forever? Isn't heaven forevermore? Do I love you? Do I, oh my dear? It's so easy to see. Don't I know I do? Don't I show you I do? Just as you love me. Do I love you? Do I? Oh, my dear, it's so easy to see. Don't you know I do? Don't I show you I do? Just as you love.
Thank you. The song that I did, Do I Love You, I mentioned three women, okay? So we've had Carly Simon and Linda Ronstadt, and that song on the album, her Grammy award-winning album with Tony Bennett was by Lady Gaga. <laughs> I recommend this album to you. It has wonderful music. Again, she crossed that barrier that folks think you shouldn't. It's wonderful music. I want to thank you for coming out again tonight. It's so special to have you here, and it's wonderful that when you hear something you like that you get to applaud. You know, a lot of times we're in church, should we applaud or not? The answer is yes. And <laughs> that or a rousing amen, that always works too. So again, thank you, and uh, as the song says, it's wonderful. I thought we'd round it off with the number that we first came in with, but with a different verse, because we hope you've been entertained tonight, and that's not all life is, but I sure hope that we can find it when it's there. Again, thank you all so much.
Thank you. That's, that's all there is. There ain't no more. Please join us for some refreshments outside and go around and tell us how wonderful it all was. <laughs> Thank you and good night. <laughs>